my name's Andrea, I'm the skincare nurse at Dermacare Direct. I'm going to demonstrate how to use the Medicate Derma Roller. What the rollers do, it stimulates collagen and elastin in your skin. Uh, it helps with wrinkles, uh, scarring, acne scarring, pigmentation, cellulite. The home use needles um, are great for getting skincare products into your skin better and also for skin rejuvenation. Now the home use needles, they come in different sizes. There's a 0.2, um, which is for beginners and thin skin. Then there's a 0.3, which is for um, tougher skin types and, and not new to needling. And then there's a 0.5 um, needle that's for people that have, that have used the 0.3 before. Um, but I definitely recommend if you've got quite severe scarring and pigmentation that you go to a clinic where they have longer needles and have a course of treatment because um, you'll get a lot better of, uh, results from it and then maybe um, use a home use needle to just maintain your results. So first of all just cleanse your face then make sure you sterilise your uh, roller to begin with so just spray the um, sterilising solution on the roller, just let it dry. You get a sterilising spray with your roller. Depending on what skin condition you're treating, whether it's wrinkles, scars, um, or just skin rejuvenation, it's a good idea to use skincare products um, with your uh, rollering. Either a growth factor, which uh, helps regenerate, repair and renew the skin, uh, a retinol that helps uh, regenerate the skin or a vitamin C serum that helps promote collagen. I'm going to use um, a Medicate Growth Factor product um, but you could you could use the Growth Factor product and then you could follow with a retinol um, and maybe use a vitamin C serum in the mornings. Um, so I'm just going to apply my growth factor all over. Okay, and then the best way to roll it is to divide your face into sections of forehead, your right cheek, your left cheek, your chin, nose and neck. Maybe your right side and your left side. Um, that's the best way of, um, of rollering. And literally you're just going in one direction and then you're going in another direction. So literally, and you're pressing quite firm on the skin. And do this and then the other direction. It's not very painful at all, it's just a prickly sensation. And then again the other side. Much easier to do this in front of a mirror. And it doesn't take long to do. And then other direction and that's it really really easy and then once you've done your forehead you move then move round to your your cheek area and then move round to your chin and move round depending on what areas you want to treat but if that's if you want to treat your whole face um, and then you can follow once you you finish rollering you can follow with a retinal product um, or if not, just follow with your moisturiser. Um, you can roll her probably about two to three times um, a week, uh, preferably at night time. And uh, you must sort of change your needlers every sort of three to six months when they start getting a bit blunt. Um, and that's, that's really how easy it is. So just to recap about what skincare products to use while you're rollering, um, it depends on your skin condition. 
Um, if you're treating wrinkles or scars or acne scarring, I'd recommend using a growth factor or a retinal product um, or both um, and also using a vitamin C serum in the morning um, and your sunscreen. Um, if you had pigmentation you were treating, I would use uh, Medicaid White Balance while you're needling and, and on a daily basis in your skincare regime. Um, with the Growth Factor product, you can use that also in your in your daily skincare regime after your C -te C -E Tetra uh, before your sunscreen. Um, so you can use it once or twice a day in your skincare regime, but also when you're rollering.